Good evening everyone. So I am Ami Blumara and my report is all about Republic Act number 8980. An act promulgating a comprehensive policy and national system for early childhood care and development or ECCD, providing funds therefore and for other purposes. Republic Act nine, nine, number 8980. There are 12 uh, 15 sections and the first section is Section 1. This Act shall be known as the ECCD Act. Section number 2. Declaration of Policy. The state states its policy promotes children's right to survival, development and particular protection while fully acknowledging the nature of childhood and its unique requirements. Section number three, the objectives of the national ECCD system are to achieve improved infant and child survival, to enhance the physical, social, emotional, cognitive, physiological, spiritual, and language development of young children. Section and section four, definitions for, for purpose of this act. Early childhood care and development or ECCD system refers to the full range health, nutrition, early education, and social services programs that provide for the basic holistic needs of young children from birth to age 6. To promote their optimum growth and development, these programs include 1. The Republic of the Philippines has a wide range of early childhood education programs. 2. Home-based programs such as the neighborhood-based play groups or family daycare programs. Section 5. System Framework and Components The ECCD system shall include the following components. A. ECCD Curriculum It aims to promote the delivery of complementary and integrative services for healthcare, nutrition, early childhood education, sanitation and cultural activities b parent education and involvement advocacy and mobilization of communities section 6 establishment of eccd system the national eccd system shall be established in at least three regions of each year as may be determined by the national eccd coordinating council to achieve national coverage over a five-year period. Section 7. Implementing arrangement the and operational structure. The implementation of the national ECCD system shall be the joint responsibility of its national government agencies, local government units, non-government organizations, and private organizations that are accredited to deliver services or to provide training and technical assistance. Responsibilities of the national government are the DSWD, DECS, DOH, DILG, DOLE or DOLE, DA, DOG, NADA, and NNC shall jointly prepare annual ECCD for work plans that will coordinate the respective technical assistance and support for the national ECCD program. Section 8. Creation of National Coordinating Council and Coordinating Committees for ECCD to ensure the sustained interagency and multi-sectoral collaboration from the national, provincial, city, municipal to barangay levels a national coordinating council and provincial city municipal and barangay coordinating committees shall be organized so a national eccd coordinating council the council of the welfare of children or cwc shall also function as the national eccd coordinating council herein after referred to as the council and shall hereby the under the office of the president so number one is composition. The council has, shall meet once a month or as often as necessary. 
or to Council Secretariat. The President shall be appointed an Executive Director of the Council who shall have the rank, privileges, and emoluments of a career Executive Service Officer. 3. Functions of the National ECCD Coordinating Council ECCD Coordinating Committee Composition Function Secretariat So, composition is the Provincial ECCD Coordinating Committee is composed of the government of the province as chairperson division superintendents of DECS Number 2 is functions The Provincial ECC Financing ECCD programs or ECCD programs at the community level shall be financed through a combination of public and private funds. All public ECCD program providers shall prioritize young children from families who are in greatest need and who can at least afford private sector programs. So the government shall support public ECCD program through cost sharing arrangements that shall involve the LGUs and counterpart funds from the national government agencies for technical assistance and support. Additional funds may be generated from intergovernmental donors and financial institutions by the appropriate government agencies through the NEDA to support the public programs in 4th, 5th, and 6th class municipalities including the urban poor. Section number 10. Appropriations. The amount of 400 million pesos per year for five years is hereby appropriated for the national ECCD program of the council effective upon approval of this act. Said amount shall be funded from the gross income of the Philippine Amusement and Gaming Corporation. A supplementary appropriations in the amount of 30 million pesos shall be provided to the Council from the President Organizational Adjustment Fund. The above appropriations shall be separate and distinct from the annual budget of the CWC. Section 10. Annual report. The Council shall at the close of each calendar year submit an annual report to Congress giving detailed account of its proceedings and accomplishments during the year making recommendations for the adoption of measures that will improve the national ECCD system. Section 12. Separability clause if any provision of this act is declared unconstitutional, the same shall not affect the validity and effectivity of the other provisions thereof. Section 13. Repelling Clause. Pertinent provisions of Presidential Decree Number 603 and Executive Order Number 233. All laws, decrees, executive orders, presidential proclamations, rules and regulation, regulations, or parts thereof contrary to or inconsistent with the provisions of this act are hereby repealed or modified accordingly. Section 14. Implementing rules and regulations, the Council in consultation with all appropriate government agencies and non-government organizations shall formulate and issue the necessary rules and regulations for the implementation of this act within 90 days after the effective duty of this act. So, Section 15, Effectivity Clause. This act shall take effect 15 days after its publication in the official gazette or in at least two newspapers of general circulation. The end.